WFNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. This Thursday, the 29th of August, this is the 10 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network Market Update. Uh, thank you to Tommy for a great start with the morning market kickoff at 9. Check it out. It's really a great program. We've got the Dow up 147 at 41,243 with all that NVIDIA noise. Wow, this is great. We were expecting legs C and D still to come in the Dow. We've missed it so far, but 41,421. Stars leg C, and we're at 41,245, up 153, got a couple of points to go. And we're looking at the S&P, also a very nice turnaround to the upside of the very weak uh, close yesterday and then a, a overnight slide. Now we're up 34 at 56.27. Love the action. Still expecting a leg D above 51, 51.62. QQQ, it's the same thing. Um, nice move up 6.10. At 477.48, it's got a long way to go to get to the 486 level to really start leg C, but I think it's still going to do that. Let's go to the IWM, the Russell 2000. Russell 2000 is up $1.77 at 290.07. Yes, it also has a long way to go to get hit that leg D, but it's still acting very well. Let's go to gold. Uh, gold is uh, trading up uh, 16 at 25.54. Remember, we're looking for leg C here. Above that leg B, that uh, peak B that was made about two weeks, or just under two weeks ago. Yeah, I've, and the weekly chart is still acting very well. Let's go to crude oil. Crude oil is trading uh, up 2.23. That's a good move because it had a couple of days of weakness, but it's still within the trading band at 76, 77. I want to see what the yields are doing. Let's go to the yields. Yields are down 17.32. So actually, sorry, bonds are down. Yields are up. I wonder if this is going to make an arch formation. Anyway, as it stands right now, very nice to see that NVIDIA. NVIDIA uh, is trading down three at 122.46. It went way down to the 115 or 114 area overnight. I like this action. I just think that NVIDIA is it's had its day in the sun. And now it's just taking a breather. It's just important. It's, a, it's still a fantastic company, evidently, from everything that was announced. The chart just says that peak D, and it didn't make that arch for that oval formation because it took out the left side low yesterday that negated that. So it's more like an arch formation. I'll be back for the Tiger Technicians Hour. See you in a few moments. And check out my opening call daily newsletter. See you in a few.